GPIO pins in microcontrollers like Arduino Nano are general purpose input output pins. They can be configured by software to act as either an input or an output. This allows them to be used for functions like reading sensor data as input pins and controlling LEDs or motors as output pins or interacting with other devices. We have a look at the pins here. There are various types of pins seen. These are uh, TX and RX pins. RX pin is input to the serial port. TX pin is the output to the ser from the serial port. RST is the reset and GND is ground. D2, D1, D3, D4, D5, D6, D7, D8, D9, D10, D11, D12. They are all the digital pins. And D13 is on the opposite side. You can see D13 here. And near the D13, there is 3V3, that is 3.3 volt output that I had shown yesterday. Then reference is the ADC reference. Then these are the analog pins A1 to A7. Then there is a 5 volt pin here which gives a 5 volt output, regulated output. Then RST, reset button, equivalent, reset pin and ground and V in. V in is the input voltage which can be given from an external power supply other than what you can give through this USB port. I have been using mostly this USB mini B or some call it as micro B also that I will power usually from the power bank. Here you can see an LED which I was connected to D13, the digital 13 pin which gives the output through a resistor to the ground. So if I switch on this Arduino Nano, incidentally this is the microcontroller board at Mega 8, it is either called as Atmel 328 or 80 Mega 328. If I zoom, it's rather difficult to see without a spotlight. 